hi guys welcome back to my channel so today i'll be showing you how i still press my natural hair now my hair is prepped and ready for the process but i'm just showing you the products that i use for long lasting silk press my silk press lasts me up to three weeks it can go for a month but when my hair needs to be washed yeah it needs to be washed so keep watching as i go through this process and also learn some tips along the way now i'm getting my hair ready to be straightened now i'll be going in and doing a bit of a detangle because when it comes to blow drying your hair even though i prepped it already you want to always make sure it is properly detangled before you go in with a blow dryer with this part, you want to make sure it's properly blown out, straight as much as you can. Quick favor guys, YouTube is showing that 96% of people who watch this channel are not subscribed. So make sure to click the subscribe button and thank you for your support to this channel. As you can, in that way it makes it easier for the straightening process. Now silk pressing my natural hair is something that I was always contemplating but after some studies on it, I said, you know what, I'm going to do this. I was more confident in doing it because for real, I love my hair. I love my natural hair. I love how far it has come but I did decide I want to heat train my hair for this year. I've started in January of 2023, that's three months ago, and this is my third time silk pressing since then. I still press my hair, I don't go in with any heat after my silk press process. I wear it like that for up to three weeks, then I will wash it take it down wash it deep condition it treat it and then i will go back in with another cell press so that's my process of doing my heat trained up to this moment so now i'm just showing you the process how my cell press is done okay so when it comes to this part of the hair, I only do one pass. If I should do a second pass, that would be if I'm going to curl the hair. But if I'm not going to curl it in that moment, then I do just one pass and that's it for me. As you see, I did touch the root about twice that is just to make sure it's straightened properly at the root and then i come straight down to the end and that's it guys now my hair is fine so it don't take much also i keep my flat iron on a low setting i don't go over 400 so i'm actually the heat setting is under 400 so that is it from my hair now based on your hair some people their hair is thicker so they may need a much higher heat but for my hair it's under 400 so guys please keep watching till the end So this is it guys yes i'm loving it guys thank you for watching take care god bless and bye